Joseph Burston, Incorporated v. Wilson, 1952. In 1950, a short film was released in New York City called The Miracle. The film was widely criticized for its sexual, political, and religious themes. In early 1951, the New York Board of Regents rescinded the license to show the film in the state on the grounds that it was sacrilegious. The producers of the film, Joseph Burston, argued that the ban on the film was a violation of free speech. The case went all the way to the U.S. Supreme Court. In a unanimous decision, the Supreme Court ruled that film is an art form and protected by the First Amendment, and that the ban on the film was considered unconstitutional. This case overturned a 1915 Supreme Court case, which said that film was nothing more than a business and not protected under the First Amendment. This case, sometimes called the Miracle Case, was the beginning of the decline of censorship in the film industry.